You know, it has been an exceptional week this week, hasn't it? Temperatures have been down high 85. The mornings have been in the 60s. Got up this morning, went out on the back porch and just looked uh, down to the pond. There was a little bit of steam coming off of it. About 63 degrees, I think, had my coffee. It was just a beautiful morning as I looked around. Reminded me of the time of year that we're in. Summer's coming to a close. Fall is moving our direction. Uh, love this time of the year. The sun is coming up later. Uh, just that chill in the air reminded me fall is coming. It also reminded me of something else. You know, over the past almost six months, we've been living in the most turbulent times. And I started out doing these videos as a little encouragement, thinking this would be over soon, and here we are six months later, and we're still going at it. It's kind of crazy. But my encouragement was as God is always there and we're six months later into this we started out with spring and now we're getting ready to move to fall and it reminds me something I told you at the very first grass withers the flowers fade but the Word of God remains forever as I look out and I see all the changes that are happening in our society can't go into Walmart Without a mask, we have to practice social distancing at restaurants. Uh, many places are still not open or at a uh, limited uh, time and amount. All because of this COVID, things change. But you know, the one certainty we have is God never changes. And I remember a promise in his word. He says, I will never leave you or forsake you. Never leave you or forsake you. God is always there with us. And even though we're going into a six-month period of uh, this virus going on, we see the virus ramping up here in Haskell County. I mean, literally 39 cases yesterday. We see that, but I'm reminded, God never changes. Things around us may change, but He's always got me right there in His right hand, and that's where I always want to stay. Let's pray. God, thank You for being an ever-present, never-changing God in a time when we see so many abandoning, time where everything seems to be in constant change. Thank you for being not that, but being the God who loves us. Thank you, Jesus, in your name we pray. Amen. See you guys next time.